If you're new, hi. A little week in the life. I love it. I just think everyone hates me. That sounds sexy. I think just accepting that certain emotions are there is really important. We're going out. Aimlessly scrolling. They also have a new cream called Booty Gain. I need some of that. And I'm just going to do it. Oh, pouring it down. I think the Stanley Cup was not on the cards. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I guess who just got Taylor Swift tickets? My life is mental. Oh my god, it is so hot. Oh, that is such a good coffee. Guys, I'm back in England. Welcome to a little weekly vlog in the summer. If you can hear banging cars, I don't know what's going on at the minute. There's just so much construction on my road and they blocked all the roads around me. So it means that every single car that needs to turn onto the main road has to come through my little road. So very noisy. So I apologize about that. I've just come into the back room to try and stop the noise. I just made an iced vanilla latte because it's like 27 degrees today. I'm gonna do a little weekly vlog because I feel like you've seen my Italy Chronicles and stuff but I'm not really showing you guys like me living at home and like going out with friends and like just making the most of my summer until I go back to uni so I thought we could do a bit more of like what I'm up to currently a little week in the life I've got a pretty busy few days coming up um Hannah's coming over this afternoon and we're gonna have a catch up and then we're going for sushi tomorrow I'm babysitting dog sitting for a couple of hours and then I'm going out for a few drinks in my friends with my friends in town which I'm super excited for and then Friday I'm going on a walk with a few other friends and then I'm babysitting and then Saturday I, I want to go out so I'm hoping that I'll find some of my friends to go clubbing with because I'm craving a good clubbing night. As of right now I just went on a little hot girl walk but it was so bloody hot so I came back and I picked up some more milk for my coffees and this is my third coffee of the day and it's like two o'clock which could be a problem. I really want to try the Chamberlain coffee. I think I might just bite the bullet and order, order some because especially in these next few weeks it's going to be really hot and I kind of just want like a cold brew to just put out of the fridge rather than like having to make it from scratch. But yeah I'm so excited to see Hannah. I haven't seen her in like six weeks. Like when I tell you I'm so excited I'm so excited. I also want to show you something really cool. I'm gonna go into more depth about it later in the video but see this. This is one of my favorite things to do is to have photos like this that you can put in the back of your phone, stick in your journal, put on your fridge. I got this really cool camera that prints them out for you so I've just been printing off a load of photos of these to like give out to friends and family so I'm gonna show you me and Hannah doing it because I think Hannah wants to print off some photos but it's so cool it's so so cool so I will show you more in depth later but stay tuned for that I've got Gracie Abrams tickets actually you know what I'm just gonna talk about that with Hannah I'll talk to you guys then because this is already seven minutes long Hannah's here guys Hi. where is it actually from Looks I feel like, like I've seen this on TikTok potentially yeah it's so cool I printed off this of me and Hannah yesterday. If I turn this on, yeah. So uh, you pick a photo and send it to me. That's yeah. cool. I've not listened to it. Has he brought his whole album out? Yeah. I've not listened to it. It's all. so good. I, well, I only listened to it today for the first time. Is it just come out today? No, it came out like this week. I really? Think. Yeah. But it's really good. Let me find a holiday photo. <laughs> I oh, what? they're nice photos. Thank you. <laughs> Lovely. Thank you. So you can pick up if you want a border. I got a white what border. What the hell? Mine. This is so cute. Or you can pick no border. I like white border. Okay, yeah, I'll have like that. that. Yeah. And then do what, you does wanna... it come out straight away? You'll see. What the I'll hell? I'll show you. Do you want to click print? Print. <laughs> okay, you can see it do that on here. What the fuck? It takes a few times and it changes colour each time. And there we are. What's it called? M Kodak M200. So there you have it. And what you can the hell? rip this like bit off at the end. It's the cutest thing I've ever Isn't seen. It? Oh my god. That is Guess so who? sweet. Like how cool is that? So we're gonna go what time is it? We're gonna go for sushi. I need to go post my vintage. Post our vintage and then Sushi? Sushi. There she is. <laughs> I'm back from sushi, had the best time, obviously, but the sushi was so, so good. But I thought I'd show you a new little outfit that I put together. I actually mean Hannah bought, just bought the same top from New Look. It was two for 14 pounds, which I don't think is bad. They're like a low-waisted cargo that I just paired with this belt. I don't know where it's from. I have a brown boot. These are secondhand from Vinted. I don't know the brand. Anyway, I'm gonna go shower. I was gonna wash my hair, but I'm gonna do it in the morning because it's fresh, more fresh, and I can't bother to style it tonight. So I'm gonna wash it in the morning and I'm just gonna have a sweet treat and go to bed because I'm tired and I just wanna blob out and watch TV. Guys, 
guys. Oh, I'm re-watching DCC because I'm obsessed. Um, that is going to be my Halloween costume this year. I'm back with another iced latte. We're going out. It's only right to have a little bit of caffeine while we're getting ready. It is only like quarter to four, but we're leaving my house at like six and I still don't know what I'm wearing. I think I'm just gonna go jeans, a little kitten heel and like a cute little top because it's quite warm out. So maybe we'll just do that. But I'm gonna show you guys when I'm ready. So little transition. The big reveal. I literally just spent so long putting makeup on because I was experimenting with some eyeshadow. Literally nothing special, but I've just got a bandeau top on and I'm absolutely sweating my off right now. So I don't know whether to wear my jeans or if I'm gonna wear a skirt. I don't have a skirt that goes with this top and I wanna wear this top, but I don't wanna sweat and stink. But anyway, I'm gonna go make some food because you need to line that stomach before you drink. So I'm gonna go make pizza. I'm actually going to keep my hair in a roller. I just took some photos and stuff, but now I'm going to put it back in a roller so it's nice and fresh. So I'll see you when we go out. I'm sorry about all the construction and stuff going on. It feels like there's just constantly construction going on all the time. I am very hungover. <laughs> I didn't realize how drunk I actually got last night. I'm still quite shaky. I've had worse hangovers, but this is definitely not the, the best. I just had a lazy morning, slept in, well, tried to sleep in, didn't go too well. This afternoon in about an hour, in about an hour, I'm getting picked up. I mean, my friends are gonna go for a little walk around a little National Trust Park that's near us and just have a coffee, have a catch up and a walk and then I'm babysitting tonight so a pretty chill night I've got a movie that I want to watch me and my little sister are watching DCC together so I think I'll finish that with her tonight and then I think I want to watch Black Swan because I've heard that movie's really good um, but I haven't watched it but I've heard it's quite dark and I'm kind of in the mood for those films although that's probably not a good idea hungover but anyway we'll cross that bridge when we come to it it is now 1.40 I think I'm gonna go make a coffee though I'm shaking so maybe that's not the best idea Guys, it is Saturday, 4 p.m. I haven't filmed anything today because I had a bit of a weird day. I felt super anxious, she says, as she's sipping her third iced coffee of the day. But yeah, I felt super anxious today. I woke up at like seven, stayed in bed until like nine. And then I filmed loads of content that I needed to do. I'm also shadow banned on TikTok, which is stressing me out slightly because I'm working so hard on these videos and then they're getting like 20 views. I then went food shopping and then my dad called me because he thought he'd been robbed. So I had to run over there, organize all of that. So to be fair, it has been a bit of a stressful day. So I think I'm gonna do some journaling, get it all out, sip my coffee. And I think I'm gonna go on a walk, maybe do a little bit of mooching around the charity shops. Actually, they're probably sure like five. Maybe just go on a walk and clear my head because I can't just like stay in the house and the weather's so nice I'm in shorts again this is just a little reminder not everybody's perfect and it's okay to feel anxious and sad for no reason and just take care of yourself you know if you need to take yourselves out of situations that make you feel uncomfortable then do it you need a self-care night do it and there's a part of me that's like you should be going out and making the most of the weather but that's like the anxious part of my brain and I need to listen to the rational side of the part of my brain which is like take care of yourself put yourself first you're fine I just think everyone hates me I hate my brain sometimes that's all. So I'm gonna go and journal the f out and I'll catch you guys later. The only reason you're catching me out in this state with no makeup on on a Sunday morning, first thing it's like 10 o'clock, is because I'm going to pick up my camera. <laughs> I'm so excited. I don't think you realize how long I've been waiting for this to come back in stock. I genuinely think it's probably been about eight months I've waited for this camera. I've literally looked on Facebook Marketplace for secondhand ones. I've literally looked everywhere and then I had a dream on Wednesday night that I got my camera and I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna check all my usual like curries, Canon, and then I checked on Argos pre-order for Sunday. There was only like a I don't know five left or something. So I pre-ordered it and I'm gonna go pick it up now. I'm so excited. 
hello it's finally gone the camera is here excuse the state of me haven't got any makeup on and i just got drenched because it started to rain so i had to shove my hair up so excited i'm so excited i picked up the canon g7x mark ii and this is like the og youtubers camera before the v10 came out this is what i wanted but i couldn't afford i need just an upgrade <laughs> I'm so excited. So I actually got the vlogger kit. I have actually worked with this brand before on one of their microphones. So I got the tripod. I feel like you need a good tripod, especially with G7X because the V10 has a built-in tripod. So you don't need one, but whereas the G7X doesn't. And this is, it looks like a really good quality one as well. Oh, that's how you screw it on. Oh, and it's one of the ones that like bends. Oh, that's sick. Oh, this just doesn't feel real, like, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. I've been waiting for this moment for like, since baby April could wanted to do YouTube. I also got um, an SD card. I don't know, there's 32 gigabytes on this, which is quite a lot, I think. It's more than what I usually have. That looks like a charger. Here's my baby. Oh my goodness. I need to get a case for it, actually, because I don't want to drop it. Oh my God. I can literally cry. I'm so excited. Oh my God. People like April is not that deep, but like, this is like a big deal for me. This is a really big deal. Oh my God, should we turn her on? Oh, she's not even charged. I'll be sick. I'm so excited. So I'm going to go set this up. And I guess the next time you'll see me, I will be filming. Oh my goodness. Oh my G7X. Hi, Mama G7X. What is happening? This is going to take some getting used to. I also don't feel like I've got the right settings on this camera. Something doesn't feel quite right about it. Okay, I think change zoom. What does that mean? I don't know what that means. I'm still getting used to this camera as you can tell, but I am gonna head out for a little hot girl walk because I've been in the house all day. I need to just get out the house because I'm getting a headache. I picked up this ring. How cool is that ring? I'm also just got this little sweatshirt on from Zara and these joggers but i need to change out of these pants because i feel like going out in joggers i just look so sluggish i don't know it doesn't make me feel my best so i think i'm just gonna change into some black jeans maybe i went to the shops yesterday to buy a fresh packet of bagels that's food on the planet right i come back home i open them bearing in mind i checked the date i got the latest date i think it was like the 15th of august bearing in mind today is the 4th of august covered in mold every single one of them apart from one there's bigger life problems i've also been on my notion grind at the minute i've been like organizing my entire life on it Literally all today has been is about my camera. I've realized I don't have a case for it. So it's like just loose in my bag. And I really hate that because obviously it's quite expensive. And I just want it to be protected. So when I go back home, I'm going to go and order a camera case. So I'm filming on my phone because I don't want to have to like keep pulling it in and out. I'm also just going to go for a little mood around B&M rather than a walk because B&M is just so fun. <laughs> get a Stanley Cup today. Getting a Stanley Cup today was not on the cards. You know what? Here we are. And here she is. You know what? Obviously it's not a Stanley Cup. I'm not spending like 40 quid in a cup. This was actually £4.50 from B&M in the sale. So if you want to get a Stanley Duke, then go to B&M. But I'm going to use this right now. This is huge. No one needs a water bottle this big. No one. I am going to be that bitch. You know what? And that is okay. I'm hopping on the trend. I'm probably like a year too late got my coffee got my stanley what is happening to me i'm actually turning into the biggest basic bitch ever you know what i'm loving every single second of it this is so zoomed in compared to my v10 i'm gonna go edit I actually have so many water bottles i did not need to get that but it made me happy that is a really good coffee kid you not potentially the best purchase ever this water bottle is 
making me drink so much water. It's just so fun. I feel like I'm turning more into Sophia and Chintzia every single day. I've been editing for like half an hour, 40 minutes. I feel like when I edit, time goes so unbelievably quickly because like when I'm in the zone, I just want to edit, edit, edit. So I'm just prepping some YouTube ideas because I'm feeling really inspired. So I'm just gonna plan out some content ideas. Also, while I'm here, let me know what you guys want to see. Someone commented that they want, like, a get ready with me. So, I do those on my TikTok all the time. So, I never really think to do them on my YouTube. But that's something I could definitely do if you're interested. Um, like, my makeup routine. I feel like I've perfected. So, let me know. I'm not being funny. My life is f mental. Guess who just got Taylor Swift tickets? I'm like shaking. I have been like crying. Oh my god. Oh. I'm going to see Taylor Swift for my best friend in August. No, because I'm just, I'm gonna need like a week to recover from how incredible this week has been so far and it's only Monday. I'm going to see Taylor Swift and I'm going to see Gracie Abrams next year. I'm unwell. I am unwell. Enough of that, I'm gonna make a coffee because I'm like... Going mad. So I'm gonna take you through my iced coffee recipe. Start by boiling the kettle. And then you're gonna wanna get your cup. I'm just gonna use this really old Starbucks one. One. Oh my goodness, life is mad. Fill this up with ice. Trying to get every last ice cube out of this tray so I can refill it. But I like my coffee in a bit more of an Americano style, so I will fill some of this up with water. Not even halfway. And then I get my coffee. It's just in there. It's like a double shot. Holy grail. Vanilla soy milk. And there you have it. The best iced coffee you make from home. Oh. It's earlier than usual for me today. Oh, 9.55, I'm already heading out door because I have a nail appointment. Best day of the month. I haven't let my nails grow out this long in months, like genuinely months. Like getting to the point where it's like, they're like getting gross. I need to go, my appointment's not until 10.45, but it takes me like 40 minutes to walk and I have to go get cash out, so let's go. do something that i've been putting off for ages so i go to uni less than a month no maybe like a month i have so many things to organize like it's not even funny i have pots i have pans i have clothes i have room decor i have so much crap that needs organizing and i'm just gonna do it otherwise i'm gonna go shopping and i don't want to spend any money because i have no money left because i spent it on taylor swift ticket so i know if i go shopping i'm gonna find so many things i want but i can't get we're gonna be productive and do something that I'm gonna put off. I'm gonna organize everything, label things, just so it's quick and easy for me to move. So we're gonna start off with the crap under my bed. <laughs> I started off just by picking up some mugs that were in my kitchen. So start with the crap underneath my bed. So far, this is how much stuff was just under my bed. It looks organized. There's so much crap in there, so much crap in there. And this isn't even anything that I need really. So this is gonna be really fun. I need to think, I'm gonna be living with three other girls next year, so I don't need as much stuff as I needed just for myself, because like we're gonna be sharing and stuff. Hair dryer, speaker. Like, what is in these bags? I mean, yes, so helpful. Oh, there's just so much. I'm really contemplating whether I wanna do this. No, I should. It just seems to be expanding, so I'm gonna go have a lunch break and try again.
I've literally just spent the entire afternoon journaling, reading, watching Desperate Housewives, and I've had the best time. Also, I made a phone case. Look how fun that is. I just printed off some photos of me and my friends and like my favorite little characters. Miffy. But it's now 10 to 6 and I think for the rest of the night I kind of want to play with some makeup because you know when like the pre-shower makeup hits I kind of want to play around with that Now like half 8 which is still really early But I played with some makeup I just put like pink and then like white and I really like it I was literally going to play with green eyeshadow but then I just thought you know what I'm not gonna wanna take it off. But here we are, gonna go, I was aimlessly scrolling, so I pulled myself out. I'm gonna go take my makeup off and have a sweet treat and get into bed. Let's go together. Okay, this is cute. Put you up against my little window. The lighting might be awful because I'm not putting the main light on because you won't be able to hear anything that I say because the fan is so loud. God, I feel like I'm giving off negative energy right now. Let's take that all back in, give out some positive energy. Um, I'm not in a mood, I'm not nothing. I'm just annoyed at myself for breaking my tripod. To vibes we'll move on everything happens for a reason if you're new hi this is a great vlog to watch if you're first watching me oh i feel like you're getting all the emotions in this vlog i just use this nivea waterproof formula with biotin it's like two pound fifty it's the only thing that gets off my waterproof mascara i live by this that you put all my friends onto it it's the best makeup remover ever and it just comes off so nicely. I use that same cotton pad and just put a tiny bit more on and then do the other eye. I did a lot of journaling the past few days and it's really got me back into my journaling era. I think it really keeps you in touch with yourself and your emotions and I think that's when I am my best self is when I'm really in touch with myself and I'm not hiding anything from myself. I think just accepting that certain emotions are there is really important and journaling is a great way to ground yourself. So if you're struggling to find a way to keep in touch with yourself, just give journaling a go. It's not for everyone. It really isn't for everyone. Me, it's changed my life. I was like starting off, I was like, nah, this is never gonna work for me. And then I was like, you know what? Let me just start writing. Even if it's like you start talking about the day, you never know something might bubble up. But I'm gonna take the rest of my makeup off and make some tea. Good morning, happy Wednesday. It's three inch inch years. Podcast is live on Wednesday, so it's a good morning. I have just been getting ready, listening to the podcast, and I've just been, it's had a really nice chill morning. I laid in bed, had some breakfast, had a nice shower. The weather is raining today. I don't think it's gonna rain for too long, maybe like an hour or so. That's okay, the weather is sad, but that does not mean that we're sad. It just means we have to work around it. And I got a parcel from Blossom and Bloom. No, Bloom and Blossom. Awesome. I don't know. They sent me one of, I think it's their like face mist. Oh, they also have a new cream called Booty Gains. I need some of that. I got the hydrating face and body mist. It says how to use mist directly on face. Okay. Oh, you can put it on after makeup. I'm not going to do that today because I quite like my makeup today. Packaging is so pretty. Are you joking? Like, look how pretty that packaging is. Let's see how that. It just smells incredible. So thank you so much to Blossom and Bloom. Bloom and Blossom. Bloom and Blossom. But the agenda today, I need to ship a parcel. I want to get some new makeup because I've been loving makeup recently and I want to play around with some fun eye look. So I want to get a blue eyeliner pencil and a pink eyeliner pencil. As of right now, I can't leave the house because it is pouring it down. So we're just going to film some content, finish listening to the pod and package up some vintage parcels. Weather is looking a bit brighter, so... I'm gonna go now before the rain starts again. I just thought I would show you my little outfit of the day. So I've just thought oh, the lighting's gonna be so backlit. But I've just got this rare jumper on from Champion, but I got it from Vinted. These jeans are Zara. I'm also five foot seven, five foot eight, and Zara jeans tend to come up quite long, so they're always like a really nice length. I'm just gonna wear my little slouchy bag, but let's go and see if we've got some bits and bobs that I want from the shops. I'm back from town. I just picked up a couple of essentials. Got two new eyeliner. Ow. Oh my god, I just like ripped so much of my hair out. I got a blue eyeliner because I've seen some really cool makeup looks with some blue eyeliner, so I really want to try some today. Um, I would try it now, but I'm going out later with some family, so I don't want to like have blue eyeshadow all over me if it goes wrong. And then I just got this white, oh it's like it's cream, but it's got shimmer in it, which I thought could be really nice for the inner corners. I've seen a makeup tutorial on TikTok that I'm gonna try. But I got sent some more PR so I thought I would show you guys what I got. I actually got a sample of some perfumes which I'm super excited to try. 
Sana Jardin. Jardin. Okay, this definitely wasn't. Oh my god, this is gonna make such a mess. Ah! Look at the state I just ripped this box and do. I'm so excited. So this is a discovery set, and it's just a, basically a bunch of samples of perfumes. And if you know me, I like to smell nice. I put way too much perfume on, but that's just who I am at the end of the day. Oh my god, look at that. Oh wow. Oh my god, I want to try one. Let's try Tiger by her side. That sounds sexy. Oh my god, I can already smell it. It's so strong. Oh, that smells like Coco Chanel. Oh, my mum will love these. I'm also gonna let her try a few of those. And then I got one more from this brand called Awaken. This is an eye mask. My room has, basically in the mornings, it's so bright. See, I'm too lazy to go and get scissors. I think this might change the game for me when it comes to being able to lie in. Rest your eyes and awaken your potential. <gasps> Oh, oh my God, they sent me a note. Now I'm gonna cry. Hey April, hope you enjoy your awake and sleep mask and you get even more out of your everyday after some amazing sleep. Love, Claire and Adam. Thank you so much. I'm gonna put that in my journal. How nicely that is packaged. It's like Christmas. Are you joking me? I'm not gonna put it on now because I'll get loads of makeup. Yeah, <laughs> kind of looks like a bra. That is so beautiful. It's so soft as well. I am so excited. Thank you so much for, ah! What is life? What is life? I just opened up my light eyeliner. I'm just gonna put it in the inner corners of my eye. Let's see how that goes. Okay, it's quite pigmented for a pencil, which I like. But like, the highlighter could just do that, you know? Like I don't didn't need to buy this. You never know. There was more to this tutorial, but I think I'm gonna do the rest of the tutorial when I'm back from my walk. That is probably the prettiest eyeliner. Can you see that? It's so pigmented, it's so nice. I love it. If I had a bit more of like a pinky eye look, I love that so much. I mean, obviously this isn't for every day. I mean, I guess it could, but I probably won't wear this every day. But it's super fun. I love having a sparkly lid. Do you see? When I come back, I'm gonna play with the blue eyeshadow. I find it important to get myself out of the house. Am I filling for that one of my one of my teeth like months ago and it's really starting to ache now, which is stressing me out because I just don't want to have to pay for that, you know?